and Sammy 101, give me a new heading of 170. Sammy 101. Yep. On your climb, let's uh, go to a new heading of 170. Climbing to maintain 150 and heading 170. Perfect. And Axel? That was a very nice turn. Let's try a really sharp turn to the right. Let's see if I can make a pilot out of you. I don't think so. <laughs> That's right. So, maintain your horizon. Yep, very good. And the turns are always gentle with the yoke. And, Sammy 103, Andrea? Yeah. Let's go ahead and level out now. I mean, that's just an amazing turn. I'm sorry. Everyone on board the aircraft's getting oh. dizzy. Sorry. Just kidding. That was my fault. So we're here to learn hypoxia. And while you're engaged, I want you to be aware of those changes as the hypoxia kicks in. And the only way we can know is if you tell us. You might notice at this point that the cabin is cooling. It's getting cooler. Yeah, I feel that. Yes, and that's normal for a decompression. Anytime you decompress a cabin, the temperature of the cabin will drop. The other thing you may notice is that your ears start to pop a lot. More so than, let's say, usual. So on the climb out, your ears are popping and the cabin's getting cooler. That's actually our very first trapped gas signal that the cabin is depressurizing. And Andreas. Yep. How do you feel? Okay. No problems? No. Am I making you nervous? Yes. I'm sorry. You're speaking very smoothly. That's I making am. you nervous. Oh. You should call me that way. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to, and that's okay, if, um, Andrea, if you start to notice some symptoms, feel free to let me know. Okay. Sammy 101. Sammy 101 reaching 15,000 feet. Sammy 101. Heading 170. Copy that. Sammy 101, climb and maintain flight level 210 and give me a new heading of 270. 2702, say again. Sammy 101, climb and maintain flight level 210. Give me a new heading of 270. Okay, 210 to 270. 270. So climb and turn. And Axel, you've been flying that aircraft perfectly. So how about we do a nice kind of banking turn to the left. Let's feel that aircraft going left. There you go. Not too far now. And Sammy 103, Andrea? Yep. Yeah. You're flying perfectly. Can I talk you into becoming a pilot? Sure. Let's do a real nice turn. Nice and easy turn to the right. Show us that beautiful little right banking turn. And I try. <laughs> now, anywhere along the way, if anybody notices anything different. Yeah, I, n I notice, Semi 101 notices a little warmth around the facial ear. Copy. Copy. Sammy 102, do you notice anything? I feel the same. Still the same. Copy that. And Sammy 103. All good. It's all good. Do you feel your heart pounding in your chest? Um, maybe a bit. Yeah, Sammy 101 notices heartbeat increasing, of course. Sammy 101 had an increased heartbeat from the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm a passionate person. <laughs> a passionate pilot. Yeah. Okay. 270 approaching and still climbing to 210. And Sammy 102, give me a nice turn now to the left. Sammy 102, Axel, turn to the left. Very nice. 
And Sammy 103, you've got your heart's pounding. Yes. Do you notice anything else? No. And Sammy 102 Axel was kind of, that's a nice turn, maybe a little aggressive. Uh, let's go ahead and try and level that aircraft out. Sammy 102, your heart's pounding, your face is warm. Do you notice anything else, Sammy 101? Sammy 101 doesn't notice anything else. Okay. I'm still able to see altitude, mm -hmm. color, everything, uh, just heat. Um, my extremity is a bit colder. Copy. I'm reaching 19,000 feet, heading to 270. Copy that. And Sammy 102, how's that aircraft feeling now? Let's try and level out. Trying to. Yeah. Do you notice anything now? Warm flushing, fingers, hands, vision. Axel? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I... Okay. You've got that look on your face. Like you're not sure what's going on. Yeah. And Sammy 103. How, yeah. do, how do we feel now? Okay. Do you notice anything? Warm? Uh, maybe the heartbeat slowed down a bit. Mm-hmm. And how about warm flushing? No. Do your hands feel funny? No. My ears are popping. Ears are popping, but you don't notice anything else? No. Sammy 101, give me a real sharp turn to 360. 360 sharp turn. And Sammy 103, that's a real nice turn. Let's go ahead and level out now. Is there anything that you can notice, Sammy 103? No. And Sammy 102, how do you feel now? Sammy 102. The heartbeat is slowing down, I think. Yeah. Something with your heartbeat. Do you notice anything else? Sammy 102. Uh, I just feel my heartbeat. Okay, yeah. copy that. And Sammy 101, you look like you're really focused right now. Do you notice, is it fixation? Are you harder to concentrate? Yeah, a bit of heartbeat. And trying to fix on the 360. Three, copy that. And Sammy 102, do you notice anything now? Axel? Heart, heartbeat, yeah. I just is that it? Anything else? You're busy flying. How does the aircraft feel for you? Axel? How does the aircraft feel for you? It feels fine. I think I can. I have control over it. Your speech seems to be slowing down. Are you having a harder time talking? Well. Yeah? It looks like you have. It looks like you're struggling. You gotta talk to me now. Come talk. I. I don't. Okay, Axel. Axel, I need you to go on the mask. Okay, sure. Yeah, do it. And Sammy, one hundred and three. How do you feel now? Um, I had an increase in heartbeat. Now it it leveled out, and then I had um, a hot. Now, now that's okay too. And now that's okay. And Sammy, one hundred and one. How do you feel now? Still able to see the 360, the 21,500 feet. Mm -hmm. And colors all here. You had warm flushing over the face, your heart. You notice a change in your heart, and you think it might be a little harder with the aircraft for fixation. Yeah, I do. Sammy 101, we suspect a cabin depressurization. Don't your mask. Sammy 101. Sammy 101 taking off the headset. Yes, Sammy 103. Yep. How do you feel now? Okay. So you, you notice a change in your heart. Your ears have been popping a lot. Yep. And what else did you have? You thought maybe you got a warm flush? Yeah, it came and now it went. So the, the warm and flush, right. And how about your hands and feet? Do you notice any tingling in your hands and feet? No. Oh. So otherwise you feel just fine. Right. Let's give me a real sharp turn to the left. Sharp? Mm -hmm. Sharp turn to the left. Sure. And there we go. That's a nice barrel roll. Let's see if we can recover. Well, that's just very impressive. You're flying upside down now. 
that you cover it towards the right or towards the left? Or can, to the either left. one's fine with me. It's just that we're upside down. Hey, trying and there, you. and there you go. That's a nice one. Good job. Let's try and get back. And Oh, by the way, how do you feel now? You have a warm flushing that went away. Ears are popping. Your heart. It's all good now. It's all good. Yeah. Okay, Sammy 103. I need you to don your mask. Don your mask, Sammy 103. Okay. Sammy 103. So I'll take the mask off. Uh, take your headset off. Oh, sorry. Yes, and now put the headset on. Okay. Bye. Okay, there you go. Sammy 101, if you can hear me, give me a thumbs up in the camera. Sammy 102, Axel, if you can hear me, give me a thumbs up in the camera. And welcome, <clears throat> welcome back, Andrea. If you can hear me, give me a thumbs up in the camera. I can't, you won't be able to talk to us. Now, let's try and recover that aircraft. There you go. You're swinging to the right. Let's kind of bank back. Let's level, look at that. I'm going to make a pilot out of you. I'm going to sight off a one-hour flight in the, your logbook in the future. That was excellent. Now, Andrea, if you notice, do you notice anything different um, now that you've put your mask on? Nope. Everything's the same. And uh, Rui, Sammy 101, if you notice your sensations getting better, give me a thumbs up. And Axel, welcome back. I was worried about you. You stopped talking to me. And uh, sometimes I wonder. So go ahead and you can now put your sims into pause mode. And I want you to really focus. I want you to really focus on equalizing your ears. We're bringing the uh, cabin down now. We were at a very high altitude. Anytime you feel pressure, I want you to equalize your ears. That was an excellent demonstration. Thank you very much. I'll see you guys on the ground. If you have any troubles with your ears, let Johnny know and we'll hold the cabin for you. Good job, everybody.